<laughs> not only has it snowed, but there's snow on top of ice. Hopefully I don't freeze my little tush off. This will be my Christmas tree next year. Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. I've had a full intention to vlog, however, the quality of the content just probably wouldn't have been there, so I have some clips on here that came and went, <laughs> and uh, yeah, I was like, I'm going to pick up my camera today, I'm actually going to go out and do some things after Mark and I came back from our little getaway. It was... A whole lot of nothing. I feel like I went through a little bit of a depression coming back. I was sad to be back in civilization. <laughs> the trip was not long enough. And uh, yeah, we just laid low. It got really cold and cloudy and not inspiring. So the sun's out today. I had a good night's rest and I'm gonna go get ready. I have to walk Winston. <clears throat> it's been a morning of uh, writing my, Ugh, hold on. It's been a morning of catching up and writing my to-dos and what's left for the, how many days do we have now? Just under two weeks or just over two weeks? Pregnancy brain, guys, is a real thing, let me tell you. Um, until Christmas, so I'm gonna get cracking on that today and bring you guys around. I am also definitely going to treat myself to a peppermint mocha because I've been craving it for days <laughs> and I think today is the day that I'm gonna go get it. Not sure if I updated everybody, but the Christmas ornaments have been found. Um, the tree is backlit. I apologize. Um, but they're here. So I have to say Christmas has fallen down on the totem pole of importance this year because of third trimester and... I just, it is what it is. We'll have a Christmas next year. Not that we're not having a Christmas this year, but I just feel like I've mega slacked. Anyways, these ornaments were typically on the mantle. Um, I feel as though like I'm still missing some. Maybe I'm not. Maybe I'm just confusing it with like the tree that I grew up with, which was an explosion of glitter and all sorts of stuff. So had I known, I feel like I would have bought more. There's just, it's just looking sparse this year. It's just looking like this, but I love it. This is the outfit I have chosen. I was slightly struggling because any indoor place that I go to, I have been profusely sweating, which is something very new to me. Um, so I'm going to put this on with like a little light fall jacket because I'll be indoors primarily. So fingers crossed because <laughs> when I am sweating and hot, I just get anxious and like, anyways, it's just uncomfortable all around. So this is a cute little ensemble from, oh my God, a cute little ensemble from Aritzia. Uh, I forget what it's called. It's not, it's not sold together. Um, there was another top alternative to this that was like a button up. It was kind of more along the lines of a sweater jacket. Yeah, I just went with this one because I felt like the sweater jacket might be on its way out, but... It seems like it's not going anywhere, but I just like this a little bit better. So there you go. Not only for the environment and the cost, but 
I'm bringing water, which I always forget. It's like last on my list. But every time I go out, I become extremely thirsty and find myself spending far too much on water that doesn't have fluoride in it because fluoride just creeps me out. And we've got this thing at home. So I just, it's always like that sweat drop emoji moment when I'm out and about walking, you know, getting my steps in and I have to go <clears throat> to the drugstore or wherever and get myself water. So bringing it with me. Oh my God, does it ever feel nice to have the sun beaming on your face? Hopefully I don't freeze my little tush off. I don't think I will. I'm okay so far. My car is covered in snow. I parked mine in the underground here and so I'm very smug most of the year when it snows because I'm not like you know sweeping snow off of it but I've been parking above ground and it snowed. <laughs> Not only has it snowed, but there's snow on top of ice. So I've got to sit here for a bit and <laughs> let the car warm up. Okay, activate seat warmers. Um, AC off. What the hell is that all about? Um, Good to see that Bluetooth is connecting. I love it. We're gonna pump up. <laughs> We're gonna pump up the heat here to 28. That's a good temperature. Ugh. Heartburn. Okay, well. I have new wipers, but I don't want to destroy them. <clears throat> Bye. Should I just try? Maybe I'll just try. Should I? Or should I give it some time? Maybe I'll do it. Oh. One more time. Oh, is that just killing my wipers? Okay, that would be the last time. That'll be the last time I do that. I'll let it melt a little bit and perhaps I'll take this opportunity to <sighs> We've made some progress here. I think this took like five minutes. This area still seems a bit frozen, but I'm gonna go ahead and do it one more time. Oh my god! We did it! We did it. Ugh. Guys, I never thought my content would be this, but it is what it is. <laughs> okay, onwards and upwards. myself to a Starbucks peppermint mocha and I think I'm gonna follow it up with a plain croissant from I'm gonna butcher the name I think it's called like Dutch house or something Swedish house pastry house I don't know I am looking for stockings some Christmas gifts 
I think we're just doing like a little girls get together on Friday. We're gonna do like a secret Santa or like steal, or, steal a present, trade a present. I don't know, but I need something for that. Um, I need some baby stuff. And yeah, I'm just like all over the place, really. What else is new? It's the Danish pastry house. I was close. Do they have just a plain croissant? Do they, do they? I mean, they must, okay. They've got a butterhorn almond. They've got a butterhorn raspberry. Butterhorn Havarti cheese, ooh. But this is the one. Butterhorn, plain. All right, the mall was a success. I got a few things from my to-do list or to-get list for Christmas and baby, which is nice. Now I'm just debating if I want a Brave Home Sense. It's a Tuesday at 2.30, but I don't know, man. <laughs> Last time I went, it was like, oh my god, it was like a war zone. Do I want to brave? There's one by, there's one closer to the house. There's two that are actually kind of in that vicinity that maybe I'll hit up tomorrow or the day after or sometime this week earlier in the day. I find that will those two are a little bit bigger and this one's like very small and overcrowded I find this one here to have like a really good selection because they have a lot of things but very overcrowded so we'll see mm. they do have a good kid section though I'm right here. I'm just gonna go. Then again, it's not urgent. No, I'll just go home. So after I was done at the mall, I came home, had leftovers from fresh that I got yesterday, and headed out with Mark to buy some groceries. Then we came home and he made the best grilled cheese I've possibly ever had. It was just like perfection. And now we're just vegging. It's about nine o'clock. I did that thing again where I fall asleep and I should probably just go to sleep, but it's so early. I think I passed out after the grilled cheese and it was like eight or like, yeah, it was probably eight. And then I woke up, I fell asleep on this chair in this spot. Um, so that was my day today. It was pretty, pretty good. I got some stuff that I needed and yeah, so it's good. It's a good Tuesday. Anyways guys, that's all for today's vlogmas video. Thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one. I'll also be sure to show you <clears throat> my little H&M haul that I did. Very impromptu. Not a lot of stuff because pregnant. And there were way too many cute holiday items that I did want to buy, but I'm really not attending that many parties, if any. So I didn't go crazy. Which is okay, I still got a lot of cute things. I'll show you that in my next vlog. Okay guys, bye.